Rescue draws together a number of important um, conversations that we've been having for a long time. So the messages aren't necessarily new, but they're right on target. And I think they come at a time when there is real openness to taking this agenda forward. And when I say taking the agenda forward, it's not so much the global environmental change agenda, but it's about mobilizing new communities of people to come on board and to change the way in which we do science as well. I think that's what, for me, what is exciting about rescue. One of the main conclusions is um, pointing to the critical and central importance of the social sciences. Um, and I think recognition that we need more social science and that we need more mainstream social science. And by mainstream, I mean social science that's been done um, in the social sciences for a very long time and that is highly relevant to the global change challenges that we face and that work has not been visible it's not been drawn in so that requires a huge mobilization effort which is why the International Social Science Council is becoming so centrally involved in this. If we want our research, our knowledge to contribute to more effective, equitable, sustainable solutions to some of these challenges, then we cannot bypass the social sciences. We will never get the solutions right unless we ask some key fundamental social science questions, questions about change, about how we make change happen, about whose vision for change counts, what are the limits to imposing change, uh, the political and cultural limits to doing that, questions about decision making and about how the policy process really works, how we um, engage political will and where global coalitions to address some of the challenges we face come. Those are all social science questions. Those are fundamental social science questions. And if we don't build that kind of knowledge into our solutions, into our policy work, I don't think um, we're going to get very far.